And this shows just how dangerous these cold temperatures can be. Developing this afternoon, a Gwinnett County mother is accused of killing her baby by trying to heat their apartment with an oven. She will stay in jail. Channel 2's Matt Johnson is live in Gwinnett County. Matt, investigators say that apartment got up to nearly 90 degrees inside. And Linda, this two-month-old baby faced challenges from the very start of her life, born with cocaine in her system. According to police, that baby spent three weeks in the NICU because of it, and just about a month later, it was right here at this apartment complex where she died in a hot apartment. They noticed how hot the apartment was. That's how police officers describe the Norcross apartment where a two-month-old baby died after her mother allegedly left the oven on to heat the home. They were having heating issues in their apartment, so she used the stove to heat the apartment. Jasmine Walker appeared in court Wednesday, accused of murder and child cruelty, nearly a year after her baby girl died on November 22nd. A Gwinnett police detective testified that Walker left baby Eden wrapped in layers of clothing and inside of a car seat while her 30-year-old mother slept on a couch nearby with the oven on. That we're still reading at approximately 89 degrees. Police arrested Walker in September after an autopsy report came back in August that ruled Eden's death a homicide. The baby overheated and sweated profusely and ultimately died because of it. A detective testified that right after Walker gave birth to Eden, Doctors found cocaine in the baby's system. Defects nearly removed Eden from Walker's home before her death, and police say Walker didn't cooperate with family and child services staff. They kept saying that she was non-compliant. She would not answer the phone. She would not answer the door. Um, and I don't believe she ever took an actual drug test. And Walker was not supposed to be with her baby alone, according to a safety plan. The child's father was on the way to Alabama when the baby died. He's not yet been charged with the crime, but the case remains open. Live in Gwinnett County, Matt Johnson, Channel 2 Action News.